to ruin Windy. This one is an easy one. People that know how to ruin Windy are not watching this video. People that want to see if they ruin their Windy right or want to ruin a right Windy, this is the video for you. It might be a simple one, and yes, it kind of is. So before we talk about how to ruin him, let's look at what makes him great in Siege and what his skills are, and then talk, go from there on how to bat on how on a how we go on about ruining him <laughs> okay let's go let's go skill one attacks the enemy three times each attack has a 30 percent chance to decrease the enemy's attack speed for two turns this attack will deal more damage according to your attack speed so the faster you are the more damage is going to deal and then skill two is a non-hit skill which is an attack speed and a crit rate buff uh for two turns okay and after skill up it's a three turn cooldown so one violent proc away from we're not using violent on him by the way we which you can but we're not you don't need to ruin him violent okay uh it's a three turn cooldown you have out of that three turns you have attack speed and crit rate up for two turns and then skill three which is his passive this is the one you want skilled up becomes immune against against the defense decreasing effects so this guy became meta when Karkana was meta because Karkana used to apply defense break with his passive so it becomes immune against defense decreasing effects and it creates a shield that is equivalent to 10% of your max HP for one turn on all allies when you attack this effect only activates once a turn it activates once a turn so skill one on speed damage skill two gets a speed buff and skill three creates a shield of your max hp that doesn't mean triple hp because you can see in his passive he can't be defense broken so defense high defense on windy is actually very very important as well because you can't get defense broken it makes you much more tankier to take hits from those fire units um yeah so that's that and he's got a dungeon to forget about this okay so how do we ruin windy so he's only got one hit on skill one a passive on skill three and a crit rate speed buff on skill two so we don't need to worry about aoe damage despair stuns and all that stuff uh we got multi hits on skill one so we can build him on additional damage and then the way we go you know what? i'll just tell you the best way to ruin um windy it is like this no it's not <laughs> for me it is <laughs> no it is actually broken sets of revenge and destroy because it's usually long matches when you play with windy a destroy set is going to help you a lot in those longer matches and uh revenge because you're applying that slow debuff with skill one and also additional damage from skill one which is a multi hit uh so the stats you want to actually the way you want to ruin him broken set it can be he's not nemesis because you're not going to be losing too much hp for nemesis to be procking uh shield it only applies for the first time you're going to be playing a longer match will no because you can't get defense broken uh destroy yes because you're going to play a longer match revenge yes because of the first skill uh what other skill runes you can go violent you can go violent you don't need to go blade we're not building them on a crit rate build shield like i said it goes in the first turn nemesis not so much you can build him on guard you can build him on no endure you can build him on guard, you can build him on energy because you want high energy, you want high defense. And that's that's about it. You can if you want. Oh, revenge, yes. I was thinking about seal, but no. So broken sets, it could be one set of revenge, one set of destroy, and then the other one could be energy, the other one could be guard. It could be anything else, okay? So, yeah. Okay, so the stats you want to aim for, you want high HP, high defense, no not really any attack good speed no crit rate no crit damage resistance he's not gonna get defense broken um he might miss a turn from a stun but if he gets hit later he will still put that shield up after having that turn cycle even if you were stunned and accuracy for skill one um the best way to ruin him is first of all you want to hit speed tick okay and the best one is 122 okay plus 122 for siege okay plus 122 for siege and you do want to you do want to build him not speed on slot two okay 
I would go one of defense and two HP. And it doesn't matter if it's two, four, six. If you got HP on two and four, or if you got uh, HP four and six, or if you got HP two and six, I would put two of them on HP, one of them on defense, and then just go for that speed, okay? So my one is defense, HP, HP, okay? Yes, this is a high speed sub. Usually high speed rolls roll on two as a sub stat, but you can get it from here. This is not that much, right? Not that much, just high efficiency, okay? High runes, high speed, high HP, high defense, and all that sort of stuff, okay? So, def mine is defense, HP, HP. Yours can be HP, HP, defense. Yours can be triple HP, defense subs, and speed subs. But I preferably like mine on a defense because he can't get defense broken. He, he is much more tankier, okay? So you wanna put one of those as a defense one, the other two on HP because he gets a shield from his HP. And like I said, uh, you might not hit my 24k HP plus 1200 defense, but if you hit 20k HP, 18k HP, 1000 defense, good enough for your level, right? And then you get better stats later on, better rolls and stuff like that. So like again, for artifacts, you want to get additional damage to HP, additional damage to speed, additional damage to defense. I'll prioritize this as HP, defense and speed for this build. Broken set, HP... And then I got speed up effect because he gets a speed buff from that skill too. Uh, that's recovery skill three is just a waste there. And I got HP here and a defense there. Um, there is another build you can build him. You can build him on a swift shield. I've never used the swift shield. I know there's a few people that you have used the swift shield, but you want to go to the next speed tick, which is plus 169. Okay, but there is a few comps that people use that just makes windy really really good especially one of the comps being bulwark windy because windy is buffing bulwark up every hit usually they like to play with the amelia there i don't have my amelia ruined it's on riley but like um because she keeps that defense buff up immunity up and um every time windy gets hit every time windy gets hit boom 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 every time windy gets hit um, Bova gets a buff every time you use skill 2, Bova gets a buff every time, etc. Okay, and like I said, these are destroy runes. So, for the longer matches, this is one set, but most of the time they use them with a tractor and a four star one. Uh, tractor is a different case because he can be targeted by Miang, he can't get defense broken, but Cichlid and Miang can target him. Where Windy, Miang cannot target him because he does not get defense broken. So, um Miang will not target windy if you take triple will units like a triple hp roid for example uh, this guy windy i don't know and a third unit and then just gives you a better chance to like survive that but cichlid cichlid can hit windy can't defense windy can't defense break windy but can reset his cooldown his cooldown on skill 2 is only three turns so it's not a big Look at this Bulwark, bro. Always stacked. Usually use Amelia instead of Riley, okay? Usually use Amelia. Look at that. Additional damage. Boom. Kills the Tessa. That is it, man. That's it for this Windy. Very simple. Very easy to ruin unit. You want to go HP or defense on slot 2. Hit that 122 plus speed. You can go one set of destroy, one set of revenge, and one anything, okay? It could be two high rolls of speed, okay? To reach that threshold. Cause that's gonna make him tanky okay that is it for this video thanks for watching like i said easy one all right uh write down in the comments what monsters you want to see next i've got a list of a couple monsters from the comments but i thought windy was the one to do today so thanks for watching yellow bye